is no me and there is no you. There's just an us. Um, and that's kind of, that's when I think about what I'm viewing and how to understand it, that's kind of what I think about. Um, my name is uh, James Mahold, um, better known on campus as Bear. Um, my, I'm a double major in sociology and religion. Um, my funding is through Ergo, and my mentor is James Vela McConnell. Tattoos and identity formation. So how people um, give meaning to their tattoos, and through that meaning, understand their self-identity and create a social identity. So I'm doing a qualitative research analysis in which I'm interviewing um, people, and the only requirement is that you have at least one tattoo, but I'm trying to break it down into three sort of subgroups um, and look at people who have one or two hidden tattoos or three or whatever, and then people who have pretty heavy tattoo coverage on their body but their tattoos can still be hidden, and then a third group of people who have pretty heavy coverage um, but their tattoos can't necessarily be hidden so they have hand tattoos or face tattoos. In interviewing them, um, I'm just asking the sort of questions that I would have with someone who I see with tattoos and I want to talk to them about it. Like, you know, when did you get your first tattoo? Why did you get it? How do you see yourself differently? How do you see yourself as a tattooed person? And how do people in your life, family members, um, yeah, I know loved ones, friends, see you, you know, from before you had tattoos to having tattoos now and what are their perceptions and do people apply meaning to these tattoos different than what you do and then also even another level of what about strangers in public, potential employers. Um, and so asking those kind of questions to kind of get to the bottom of, because the idea behind symbolic interactionism and in social psychology in general is just that without the interactive process, without the me and you talking to each other, there is no self, you know? And that's sort of how, how we, we can't understand ourselves without having interaction with people.